Welcome to Serenity Productions. Hi! <laughs> um, so this is gonna sound a little probably unprofessional, but I work next door and we've just ran out of ones. Can I give you a 50 in exchange for some of yours? Yeah, it's a really busy day and we can't afford to go to the bank. Mind helping out a fellow retail worker? <laughs> oh, you're a gem. Neat register. <laughs> it's pretty old. Oh, really? Wow. <laughs> you guys must have taken... Really good care of that thing for it to last that long. Okay, see, that's what I keep telling my uncle. We should get an old register and it would fit the vibe of our place really well. <laughs> Thanks, you're amazing. Um, why don't come you come over when you're done with your shift? Free coffee, on me. No, seriously, it's the least I can do. <laughs> okay, I'll see you later then. And thanks again. Order for Michael, one blonde roast with almond milk. Thanks, have a good day. <laughs> <sighs> that was a hell of a rush. I can help who's next. Oh, hey, <laughs> it's the wonderful person from next door. You came just in time. In fact, I think you're probably gonna be our last customer tonight. Oh, ignore them. My coworkers can be a bunch of Karens sometimes. Good night, ladies. I can clean up myself. I'll be fine. I'll see you all in the morning. Please try to be on time this time. Bye. Don't worry about them. They're just a little wary of you because you work next door. Honestly, if you ask me, they've heard one too many horror stories about your shop. Oh, you know, just stupid shit. Like things glowing, weird noises. <laughs> the rumors about you running an occult store have been flying around since we've opened. Pretty sure they think you sacrifice virgins in the basement and everything. Oh yeah, and you have a Ouija board too? Oh, let me guess. Black candles, right? <laughs> me? Mm. I just think they don't like the fact that you practice in different things than they do. Yeah. I mean, you guys are into the whole holistic view and herbal medicine, right? Maybe I can ask for your advice on back pain then. Working all day on your feet sucks. So, what am I getting you? Sounds good. Just give me a minute and I'll get that ready for you. Hmm? Yep, that's my name. <laughs> My mom was a huge King Arthur geek as a kid, and thought the name would be funny. <laughs> you wouldn't believe how many witch jokes I get on a daily basis. Honestly, it's enough to make me sometimes wish I had magic. Nah, I'm not really a believer in that. I mean, I believe there is something that we can't explain. 
Maybe a bit of energy going on in the background. But magic? <laughs> nah. <laughs> if that was the case, wouldn't we already know about it? I mean, that's a pretty big secret to keep, right? Especially with everybody walking around with their own camera and their phone nowadays. Surely someone had to pick something up, right? <laughs> See, you get it. <laughs> so, now that you know my name, what's yours? Nice! <laughs> Okay, see, I like that so much better than my name. Nah, it's really unique. I really do like it. <laughs> Here you go. Can I grab you anything else? I still have a few pastries left. Trust me, my uncle's chocolate chip muffins are to die for. I'm surprised there's even one still left. Alright, I'll warm it up for you. You know, I kind of feel bad. Yeah, I mean, we've been working here for like five years, and I've never gone by to say hi or anything. We just kind of opened up next to you and never even said, hey neighbor! Oh, my uncle's a little skittish. Though I should have made the effort to go over. You know, considering that I'm the niece of the owner of this place and everything, and, you know, if he's not going to be bold enough to say hi, at least I should be, right? <laughs> so, how long has your place been open? Whoa, that's a long time. Uh, no, that's, that's like super cool. I'm hoping that we can do the same thing here with the coffee shop. Pass it down from generation to generation. That would be nice. Here you are. Oh, please, it's my pleasure. Seriously, you saved my ass earlier. It got to the point where we even took from the chip jar and it wasn't enough. I don't think I've ever seen a crowd that big. Oh yeah, and most of them were like the weirdest business people. I think they were from that weird government building a few blocks down. Do you know what that is, by the way? Really? Huh. I didn't know this city needed a building that big for citizens' protection. <laughs> well, you learn something new every day, right? Oh, you don't have to go immediately, you know. You can stick around. I'll just be cleaning up. And you won't be in the way. Plus, talking with someone will make the cleanup go a lot faster. If you don't mind, that is. I, I don't want to take you if you have to, you know, close up your own shop and do your own inventory and whatnot. Yeah, I like talking to you. You seem like cool people. And I kind of want to get to know the person that works next door a little bit better. You know, after years of not saying hi. <laughs> oh, trust me, I will be making up for that a while. <laughs> it was completely rude of us. <sighs> this creep again. Don't worry about it, it's nothing. <laughs> nah, just some asshole that she's trying to get with me. I told him no twice already, and he knows he's not allowed to come into the store. So now he just hangs outside and waits for me to come out before he starts harassing me. I've tried to call the cops, but because he hasn't really done anything, their hands are tied. How convenient, right? You don't have to do that. 
really, you... All right, your life. You do you. Idiot is gonna get themselves hurt. Maybe I should have 911 on dial already in case I need to call an ambulance for them. What was that? What the? Hey, is everything all right? Well, no, I just saw him running off screaming and... Well, that must have been one hell of a talk you had with him. And something tells me I really don't want to know. <laughs> Thank you, though. Guess I owe you another coffee. Okay, if not a coffee, then what? <laughs> I can definitely have a conversation. Come on back in. I'll lock up the door and get to paying you back. 